Testing my phone. Still working. Working. All right. Let's switch back. Back. Go to the next. <laughs> welcome in. Welcome in. Good evening. Welcome back to the Lunar Dreamer Denmates. My name is Jiro Yodokuma. Onkoma boko no namai wa yodokuma Jiro des. Your co-pilot of the Lunar Dreamer and your friendly space moon bear VTuber. Welcome in. Hello to Honey Dory. We got our first redeem. <laughs> hello, hello. I hope all of you are doing amazing. We are playing Minecraft tonight. Hopefully, it's just gonna be a short stream. <laughs> we have a goal set today. We're gonna look for at least two. <laughs> Maxwell! <laughs> Welcome to Toby. <laughs> Thank you for the Maxwell redeem. So cute. And he, and he like spawns right beside me too. <laughs> Hola. Welcome in Plum. Um, welcome in. Thank you for dropping by. I hope you're doing awesome. Alright. Last time we played Minecraft on this world. For you today, I'm doing, I'm doing great. We had our early stream couple hours ago, not really a couple. I had an early stream at 10 a.m. today, so some hours ago. Now we're back playing Minecraft. Just uh, two streams for today, and it's been really fun so far. Your day's going good as well. <laughs> Thank you for the redeems, guys. Toby with four adventures. Amazing. <laughs> Alright, so last time we played Minecraft on this world. Love that remote. Where did that come from? So cute. <laughs> Tiny little lion. Like tiger. No, it's not a lion. That's a tiger. I'm miscategorizing my animals. This is embarrassing. Tiger. <laughs> so, content layout. My mod a little bit. I should really find a way to automate this. <laughs> I have to switch screen all the time. Today is going to be another cozy stream. Well, at least I'll try to make it as cozy as I can. We will be looking for cauldrons today. And if you remember, last time we played Minecraft on this server is... Um, when was it? December 22nd, on our last scheduled stream of 2023. So we spent two hours on this one. We were looking for a cauldron, so we didn't find any. Deno, welcome in. Ah, kitty. We do have Twitch integrations happening. So, um, new followers get a random pet named after them. That's from Night, Night Sade. And the bird is, um, Juniper Bun. <laughs> and I also get special events on subs uh, subscriptions. I get a shulker box with the uh, gifts. Oh, let me change my game mode. Here I was. There we go. Survival mode. We are at zero HP because we died. Um, this chat told us to jump off this cliff because we're an amazing streamer who makes stuff for content. We did jump. <laughs> Our gravesite is somewhere in here. I think we can start off with that actually. This is where our last um Oh actually I think it's way deeper than that. I think we went all the way down. But welcome in Deno. Hope you're doing oh, amazing. It's been a while since um since we got it's been like been it's been a year. <laughs> Australia, I don't have anything! Toby! 
<laughs> Toby, no! God, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Well, at least I'm glad to know that's still working. <laughs> now I'm the other side of the ravine. How do I get there? I only have paper, Toby. <laughs> hey, they just summon all those spiders. Oh, hi. I guess they're not aggressive. Why are they not chasing me? Interesting. Huh. They just... Huh? Huh? Look! They're not chasing me. That is interesting. You can see on the minimap, everything has Toby's name on them. That's bad luck Toby's minion. <laughs> right. But, spiders just ran away. They haven't attacked me. Oh, I think I know why. I think it's because it's daytime. I don't think they attack at daytime. And I'm pretty sure I fell... I fell here. That's, that's where my grave went. Oh yeah, I see it. It's over there. Yeah, that's where we died then, mates. Anyway, that's where we jumped last time we streamed. Over there on that amazing... See, that's our grave right there. <gasps> I have Optify. Okay, maybe we can break down. The problem is, if we go there, alive, how do we get back up? Hmm. I don't think there's anything in those graves anyway, but we don't have any EXP. We don't have any net cereals items with us, so I don't think there's any harm in trying to drop them. Out. Okay, that didn't hurt quite as much. This is our grave. I have a mod that gives us... Oh, I only have um, stone swords and stone axe. That's really nice. Look, I'm in there, no? Uh, I was saying. <laughs> it's been a while since we got together. Pokemon. Kind of like, kind of like playing Gengar, that game. Climb up out of the hole. Hopefully, we get back to the waypoint based on that we're just where we just came from. Parkour skills. Oop. I think we just lost our cat. Doing well, stressed for, streamed for about an hour. No. Didn't want you. <laughs> There's a continuation. That message. <laughs> I knew there was a con there was something else in that man. I was like, didn't want you. you didn't want me. <laughs> All right. That's the ingredient. Right? That's that's perfectly fine. Now, uh, you know, take care of yourself first. Don't. There will be no more. That's not something that we want. Background noise. <laughs> not that great at isolating. Yet. Uh, oh, there's the waypoint. See. Have Optifine Zoom. Love this feature. So I, I'm using a mod called Optifine, which allows you to use these shaders. I summon chickens. We don't have a uh, chat summon commands enabled, uh, Toby, unfortunately. <laughs> I turned it off for the sake of my sanity. And can I to ruin this world it's very sentimental <laughs> this was the very first world i uh, created when i started streaming and kind of want there to only have one ender dragon <laughs> oh uh, what 
shaders are these. These are um, complementary, I believe. Yeah, it's complementary. I use. Let's see. Oh God, not Australia. It's it's daytime, Toby. I think that's a mechanic of um, Minecraft that if it's daytime, the spiders are not aggressive. So um, <laughs> the yeah, the spiders are just gonna chill there, not gonna bite me. I don't think they attack unless it's nighttime or it's or they're underground. Yeah, they just crawl around. They're they're nice spiders in the daytime. <laughs> Look at them all, so cute with their eyes and their five, six, eight legs. <laughs> but anyway, definitely should do something again soon, you know? Wow. So we're gonna go back to the playstone, but we don't want to go through that huge ravine. We're gonna walk around here. For bed, need wool. The vibration of my phone was heard on that mic. <laughs> I hope it didn't. Right. Yeah, so we're at the waist. Take this home really quickly. Wait, I don't have I don't have enough, enough experience to get to go back here. Need No, I, I actually needed those sponges. <laughs> Alright, let, let's try this. Uh, I don't think that I mean it's night time. Ah! Kill the spideys. Oh, look at the kitty! He's, he's, he's purring! Did you hear it? <laughs> Kitties are in bed. Look at this, look at this. I'm gonna lay in bed. Oh wait, no. We're gonna wait till 6.30pm. Then if you listen carefully, you're gonna hear the kitties actually purr. That lazy cat just sleeping in the bed. <laughs> Didn't know that they do that. It's so cute. <laughs> King Kitty. Kitties. We do need two levels so we can go go home using the waystone here. I'll drop off our stuff that we found. I don't think we still found the cauldron. Um, and then back and continue our adventure I guess we're here okay, so let's take all of these actually torches that's good we got the buried treasure map some then maybe we'll just leave some of these in here you know just just um this is a Precaution. Less precaution. Use of emergency. I should probably. Ah, I can go back. That's what we're gonna do today, then, mates. We're going to. And. Lost my train of thought. to check in I wonder hope you have that hope you have a wonderful stream thank you so much for checking in Zeno 
you need your rest, so you have to take your rest and take care of yourself. And I'll see you again in the future, either on your stream or mine. <laughs> have a good night. Alright. Okay, then we are going to look for Toby's spider minions. They should still be here. Hell did they Huh? It didn't despawn, did they? No way they could have despawned. Just right. Oh, I think it despawned. Huh? So weird. They should have. I don't know how that happened. Yeah, where's our dirt blocks? Get some dirt blocks in here. Climb this way. Yeah. Will be spiders go? Yo, they actually disappeared. I was gonna kill them. Oh, that is shitty. I wanted EXP, bro. <laughs> Alright, well. Mm. Well, I don't really want to live in Savannah because one. Ah! Oh, God. <laughs> That's me. Thank you, I guess. Oh god, oh god, okay, okay, these ones attack me. I don't know why. Okay, that one. Alright, now I have two levels. Okay. Thank you for the spiders, I guess. Ow! Okay, they're gonna actually gonna kill me here. <laughs> Why are they chasing me? Okay, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I need to eat something. I need to eat something. <laughs> yeah, I don't wanna risk it. I'm gonna die. Fuck off. Ah! <laughs> oh no, our 2 EXP. Well, we know where we died. Minus 644, minus 2237. We had all our stuff too. 644. Okay, definitely not. Minus 644. How did we get there? Huh. Can't go there, obviously. Yep. So I guess we have to go around old fashioned way. Welcome in, Diego. Thank you for the first time chat. How are you doing? Hola buenas. See if we can change the subtitles here. Um, thumbnails. Uh, subtitles. And yes, there we go. That should work. Hello, good evening. Hola, buenas tardes. Perfect. It translates in Spanish. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having an amazing evening. And if you haven't noticed, we have subtitles at the uh, lower, lower left corner, <laughs> just in front, uh, just below the uh, the game screen. 
which would allow you to see um, translations in Spanish. You have it set to Japanese by default, just because my um my VTuber Papa is act is uh, Japanese. <laughs> kind of um I just got, I just kind of gotten used to. It. But I do have um, Spanish subtitles. Maybe in the future, find a way for my overlay to uh, to support the uh, three lines of translations. Oh, I see my corpse there, right, right by the spider that killed me, and I'm back. Where's that? Ah! Toby! <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh god. Yeah, oh my god, there's so many fucking spiders. <laughs> oh god, okay. Well, they haven't seen me, so I can run away, I guess. Because it's daytime, they're not gonna attack me, right? <laughs> Chaos. <laughs> okay, we'll kill one. Get our two levels, okay, that's a level. Then we're gonna tempt another one. Oh god, I hate this parrot. Okay, okay. Let's go this way. Ow! There we go, two levels. Okay, now we can run away. <laughs> okay. Us, um, and we're back. Alright, I don't think I need all of the other spiders. So, and it's getting. It's almost nighttime, so we'll run around again and try to get to the. Um, try to get back to that way. Maystone. Wait. I should probably put the dirt something here. Take that egg away. Just so we can, you know, oh, nope. Just so we can travel safe. I don't know why I haven't. There we go. I have so much dirt. I don't know why I'm skimping on it. Alright, now we just have to walk all the way back around. You know what I should do as well? I should build a bridge here. Yeah. That would be cool. From right there. But we're gonna go to sleep first. Then we're gonna drop off our stuff to our base. Then go back here and continue our adventures. We have lots of wool, we have lots of wooden planks. Can just spawn beds anywhere we like. Yes, right now the only thing that chat can summon are spiders, and Toby seems to be uh, on hand with that. <laughs> Thanks so much for the redeems, by the way. I appreciate it. Respawn point is set. Why it always disconnects like that? Bridging. Ah, I'm out of dirt. No way. Okay, well, we're going, we're going to go sleep. If the spiders over that um, will be summoned are still alive, that will mean that there's something wrong with... Um, there was a glitch or something. Now we can drop off here and make some kind of stairs. Go. Perfect. I'll just do the same on the other side. 
make a nice little bridge. There we go. <laughs> yeah. We don't have to um we don't have to walk around anymore. Alright. My window. Go close that one. Then uh we are I'll, I'll be right back, hold on. Stuff there. Spider eye. I don't really need those, right? And that. Okay. Lots of obituaries. I should really change this. We don't need it anymore. But it's still there. So we're gonna look for a way to get rid of it. <laughs> we do have lots of planks. Uh, just put it there for now. Scaffolding goes there. Yeah, it's good to go, I guess. Now we can go to Puma Base. Alright, yeah. Yeah. Back home then mates. This to kind of jump here. There. All right. So what we're doing today, our goal for today, is um, we need to expand this. We only have one cauldron. This la this cauldron thing. We're gonna look for that in a village. So that's what we're going for today. And I look for hopefully three. So two on each side. So we can have more fuel for our um, smelters. And then maybe we'll look for another um, uh, kind of expand this. This is where we mine our clay. Yeah, so there's like um dripstone underneath, which if you turn dirt into mud. It will dry out as clay if you put it here. And I kind of want to build a structure around it. Uh, but for now, go into our house. Going inside the house. Then. Oh, Shranzina! Oh, that's so cool. We have a pet. We have lots of chests here. There. Oh my god, I have so much stuff. For now, let's put all of it here. Oh, put that there. Don't really need that much sticks, do we? Put our paper, our lapis, of course. Uh, iron nuggets. Don't really need iron nuggets for now. Put an egg in there, sure, why not? But we need a bed. We need to make a bed. And let's throw our obituaries into the lava. Hopefully, hopefully it gets swallowed in. Yes. Oh. In there. There we go. Ah! Now we're just gonna throw this other one. Oh. Hold on. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> Alright. Now we are going to 
Hi Kitty, do you have a name? No, you're Slurpa. Ah, you know what? Maybe I should make my cats. Wait, where did Nightshade go? <gasps> did he get left behind? Oh no. Wait. Why is my why is my parrot the only person the only pet that went through? Juniper? Huh. Interesting. Looks like the follow looks like the pets don't go through waste zones. Ah, okay. Well, anyway. Is our inventory? Oh wait, the parrot is on my shoulder. <laughs> Look at that. That's so cute. Um put the planks there. We need more than four. And we do have a chest of dirt here. Right there. We'll just get 36. That will be good. Mm. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna Hi Juniper. Hello little birdie. You're doing amazing. Alright. What we're going to do is we're gonna grab this. He grabbed the boat there. Oh, he did craft a bed. <laughs> I always get sidetracked in this game. A bed. 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 We have a bed. Tenemos la cama. Now we're gonna go back to the waste zone and go back to that um, cliff location thing, which we should actually make a note of. Let's see, where's that thing? Monument. Where are we? Which Minecraft world is this? The uh, Home 280 minus 808. Looks accurate. 280. Alright. Looks like accurate. Huh. Why did I put my access token in a different notepad? <laughs> Hold on. I'll be right back. All right, we are back. Huh? Oh my God! You scared me. You. <laughs> Oh my god, the parrot just imitated the zombie noise. And it scared me because it played literally on the right side of my headphones. <laughs> uh. Alright, we are going back to the um to the cliff um waystone. Which we're gonna make a note of. It's up. Why do we have a note that says post disaster? And the coordinates to the Savannah village. Why do I have that? Waystone. If. Alright. Oh, and I have Optifine, which means that the torch that I'm holding sheds light. <gasps> Look at that. I missed Optifine. I made the mistake of creating a Minecraft world in 1.20.2 which is not yet supported by Optifine so that meant that I had no shaders available you see Optifine takes time developing a version of their a mod for each new version release so if the new Minecraft version is 1.20.4 chances are they probably don't have Optifine for it yet so you'll be need you'll you'll be playing Minecraft with either the default shaders or find another 
um, shader loader. Yeah, and we still we have this mysterious villager here, standing on a one block, half a block of water. I I don't know what's I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> Mm, I think there's a bed here. Oh, there's a chest here. Oh, that's cool. With stone. Interesting. That is not a bed though. Do you have a bed here? Is that a bed? That, oh, that is a bed. Yeah. Sounds good, sounds good. I guess we'll just wait until 6.30 in this village then mates and then we'll... Oh, you know what? We actually don't eat. We actually don't need to, you know why? Because there's also a bed where we're going. <sighs> Fuck! Oh god, okay. At least that's free. Oh, he was sitting in there. Aw, kitty. So cute. He was sitting on the bed. The weird thing is, we didn't ask, we didn't ask him to sit, sit there, he just did. See, they just sit up and stand up on their own. <laughs> Good morning. Now we're going to continue our adventure. We do have a bed. We do have a boat. And we can't always um, just use them as we need. So now we're going to continue looking for a village. And we will do that by going west we'll continue our journey west we're gonna leave this behind oh right we're gonna need to write the coordinates of this place waystone cliff is at four and minus two one six six All right we're going to go west buy house Hopefully we find more. First of all, we have she. <laughs> Hold on, we haven't made a sword. Our sword is almost. Our sword is almost gonna break here. We have an extra axe. We don't have an extra pickaxe. Oh God, not Australia again, Toby. Why do you do this? <laughs> oh God, you're just waiting for the perfect timing, aren't you? Well, too bad that you summon them in the daytime because they will not, they will not attack me unless I attack them. Ah, all right. And my mouse is my mouse battery is getting low. So, oh, we were gonna we were gonna make a stone sword, but I really don't want to risk it. We'll just make a stone sword out of the planks that we have from here. Uh, or better yet, we can just chop down a random tree. Like this one over here. Just do that. sword from here and right now we have a sword well a spare one you know what maybe we should make another one just in case all right and we're gonna leave the crafting table there because we don't need it we have quite a lot of uh, we're gonna go west then mates so we're gonna go this way Why are we going this way? Because I kind of ah fuck I almost fell there. Well, I, I didn't really almost fell. I actually fell. <laughs> but anyway, we are going west because our current coordinates are minus eight seventy and minus two one eight five, and I kind of want to see what's on minus two one eight five. Like uh, I want to explore like um symmetrical coordinates. If you can call it that, you know. Try to get as close to 
equal numbers as possible. Part of me is curious what's on minus 2185 on the x axis, minus 2185 on the z axis. I don't think we're gonna build anything today, then, mates. Partly because uh, I don't believe we have enough materials for it. I mean, we could go back to the base and build such structure, but. I would honestly just rather explore and see if we can find a cauldron. Not like looking for a cauldron is um, ranked, uh, prioritized less than building something. It's just that I think that if we found more cauldrons, it would make our work easy. Because then we won't need to make uh, to use coal or even find coal. We can use that for something else. And welcome in to those who are new to the stream. The reason we're killing sheep. Um, mercilessly is because they provide wool for us. Wool is what we need to craft beds, which in Minecraft acts as a respawn point. The only problem is, once you sleep on the bed and decide to break it for some reason, and if you break it and then you decide, oh, I'm going to reuse the bed in another location, you kind of reset your spawn po respawn point. And if you don't have a bed that you slept on and you die in the game for any reason, instead of respawning where your bed used to be, you respawn at the world spawn point instead, which can be, for me, it's like 2,000 blocks away. <laughs> That's why we take it upon ourselves to make sure that we have quite a bit of wool in our inventory at all times of course a sizable stack of planks of any type but there's plenty of trees in minecraft and it's not really that hard to find a tree i mean i guess if i guess unless you're in a snowy biome and there's nothing but ice for blocks and blocks i mean for thousands and thousands of blocks but in all other biomes, you'll be able to find the tree. And currently we are exploring the world. First time we're not really first time. First time we're doing this expansive of an exploration, actually, in this world that we made. This is the first Minecraft world that I generated when I started streaming three months ago. I I generated it as some kind of test, to test my stream. You know, just to check the audio and stuff. Then it actually turned out well. I didn't encounter any bitrate issues. Well, at least none that I knew about. <laughs> didn't encounter any lag in the video, audio, network. So I just thought, hey, maybe I can use that video, uh, that footage, as my first stream and post it on Twitch. That's where it started. That's where I started becoming a VTuber. <laughs> and I kind of held a special place in my heart this game because uh, I like how peaceful it can get. And how okay, and ah, I almost fell. <laughs> how chaotic it can be. It's up to you, actually. Rainforest there, then, mates. Yeah, should we go there? Maybe we shouldn't. Let's continue going 500 more blocks. Yeah. 
and I hope you're all doing amazing then mates thank you so much for dropping by and uh, dropping by the stream saying hello even if it's only for a couple minutes I appreciate it a lot they won't come in I don't even know why I'm collecting coal I don't need this anymore <laughs> you have a lava thing now that's the thing, right? Um, would be nice to find a village that has cauldrons already. But I don't think we can find it in the ocean, so we might need to steer, steer clear. Oh, cool. Find five two. Now have almost a full stack of coal. Hmm. What is that? Huh? Oh, those are bees. Okay. That scared me. <laughs> Probably make sure that we don't disturb the bees. What's in here? I think this is the this is a plains biome. It is. The chances there's gonna be a village here very slim. I don't think villages spawn near the water, honestly. Yep, slim to none. Hell, oh, I see a snowy biome over there. Maybe we can keep that as notes. Actually, we don't really have a respawn point. There's a random snow-capped mountain, it looks like. There's a small patch of uh, snow amidst the forest. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how that happened. So weird. Continue exploring. It's already 6.30 p.m. So that means we get to go to sleep. Night cow. Set a respawn point. Get to build a crafting table. Well, then we're gonna go to bed. Okay, now we continue going south. West, I mean, our journey west, or should we continue going west? Oh shit! Did I? Oh, okay. But I took the bed for a second there. What is this? Oh, that is cool. Bunch of coal here as well. You see, that's the funny thing, is that when you're not looking for it, especially in this game, it shows up. And then, the moment you're looking for coal, for whatever reason it may be, it doesn't show up. We are continuing our search for a village. Oh, that's a, that is a zombie! Okay, burn. Burn in the sun, zombie. We are playing on hard mode. Yes. This hard mode is. I have a rabbit's foot. I don't need this. That stuff. Get away from here. Alright. We need one more. Just to make sure that our health and hunger bars are full. Which honestly is such a relief compared to the hell that we went through on our New Year's Minecraft stream. <laughs> that was it. That was something different entirely. Is that a jungle monument? Hello? The nether portal then mates. Ah. Be a chest here. There we go. 
that. All the nuggets. Do we really need it? No. We don't really need it. There's no obsidian there, so it's really kind of pointless. Now we are approaching a stony shores biome here. And I don't think they build villages there too. So I guess Yeah, that's a stony shores biome. Like look, look at everything. Well stony shore, there you go. The moment you step foot on it, it says stony shore on the the minimap. I really like this minimap because it shows you not only the coordinates where you are, you don't need to spend all of your time on F3. Oh, an option for you to identify what chunk you're on. What chunk is a 32 by 32 group of blocks? Mostly used for identifying where creatures can respawn or where items can drop or when they're gonna start disappearing once you're not loaded the chunk and it also identifies which events in the chunk get fired at a random interval I think it's very neat to have that uh, both the regular coordinates and the chunk coordinates on the minimap other than that, it also shows you current time of day and the light level where you are. Time of day is perfect when I'm underground and I need to figure out when I need to sleep. <laughs> because I think even underground, more mobs spawn at night. It's not only an overworld thing. Even if you're down mining, I think more mobs spawn at night uh, under under the mines. In addition to the ones that naturally spawn there during the day, just because the light level is really low. Mates, do you have an ad about to start here then mates? So please feel free to take this time to uh, stretch, hydrate, grab a snack, relax, and um, I highly appreciate your support for the channel. Thank you so much for uh, sitting through the three minutes of ads. It allows our new denmates to discover our short, uh, our short, our cozy little stream here because it allows them to enjoy it without any interruptions from pre-roll ads. That's what, uh, that's what the ads do every three minutes. All right. We go here. Can't believe it's been an hour. I haven't really, I haven't found a village yet. Huh. Part of me stems it. Ah, a waystone. Ah, look at that. Look at that, then mates. Waystone out in the wild. Totally use that for something. That is going to be so useful. That is going to be extremely useful. <gasps> oh no, Kuzi. <sighs> Kuzi Senpai is here. <laughs> oh my god. Welcome in, Kuzi. Thank you so much for dropping by. Let me give you a shout out here. <laughs> Go. It's going to make a jet uh, a summary of your channel it's gonna do it in a movie director script which i have to read oh my god okay let's do this <clears throat> in a world where survival and karaoke collide uzi vt the intergalactic bounty hunter embarks on a cosmic quest from vampire survivors to dreamlight valley adventures Join them for chill vibes at interstellar friendship. Interstellar friendship missions. <laughs> Will they conquer the ultimate survivor challenge? Tune in for laughs, drills, and cozy nights. It's not just gaming. It's an epic journey through space and sound. Oh, that's, that's cool. <laughs> well, welcome in, welcome in. Thank you for dropping by. We are looking for a village. Can see it's a lot of walking 
<laughs> we have an ad starting soon, then mates. So, uh, thanks once again for staying through the ads and supporting my, uh, supporting our little channel here. <laughs> we will see you after the break. And the ad should have started according to Twitch. Uh, for some of our uh, then mates here and we're at the plains biome we still haven't found a village but we do have a waystone though that's a thing it allows us to teleport to our, um, our house Yeah, it allows us to teleport to the, uh, our, we do have a, oh, let's say, waystone name for the low, low cost of, uh, levels, which we have four of. We can go back to our base, our home base here. That's where I died. <laughs> this is the, this is the uh, location on the, um, by the cliff. But of course, we don't really need it yet. We haven't found a village yet. We jumped the gap. <laughs> we are now going south instead of west. You know what? I don't, I don't even know if jungle villages exist. I don't think they do. Cauldron Doko. We, we still haven't found a cauldron yet, Kuzi Senpai. <laughs> I just wanted one for my... I mean, I can build it out of iron ingots, but that would take so much time. And I would rather... I would rather use the iron ingots for something else. Like, um... Uh, armor or something. <laughs> but... Right now, we don't have any luck finding a village with the blacksmith. I think it's the blacksmith that has the cauldrons. Getting late in the game. So I think we need to make a bed. And continue our adventure for another day. Is that the same? That is the- oh my god, we just walked in a circle. <laughs> that is the same patch of snow that we encountered. 20 minutes ago. <laughs> Have we just been going back? <laughs> alright, alright. Oh my god, that means that our our last bed should be in here somewhere too. <laughs> fine, fine, let's make a bed. Yeah, let's go to bed. So cute when the cat lays down on the bed and purrs like that. It's so refreshing. <laughs> Damn it, we just, we just went around. Okay. Make planks, crafting table. Smash Master, welcome in. Thank you for the hydrate relief. <laughs> ah, okay. Okay. I, you know what? On, in retrospect. I should have done my hydrate and posture checks when the ads were running. <laughs> um, what are we building? Oh, we're building a bed. Building a bed to replace the one we have. Because once we get rid of that, our respawn point disappears. Popping in to make you take care of yourself. Ah, that's so sweet, Smash Master. Thank you so much. <laughs> going going this way we're going south ah. just want to find a village where's that zombie going oh it's a zombie with armor run can we kill it you know what i think we can you want to know how we can all we need to do is do this too high block 
then we can just crouch and then that wait for them to come back oh the sword broke ah how many hearts do you have oh damn you're chunky This is a very slow. Oh, there we go. Never mind. And it gave me boots. Golden boots, though. So it's worthless. Worthless boots. Okay. I think it would be better if we go. You know what? Let's continue going west. Even if we encounter water, we can just sail across. Be like, um, be like one. <laughs> yes, we literally just went by this area here. That's no biome on the map, on the minimap. We just saw that. <laughs> we literally just saw this earlier. Oh, the grove. Nah, I've been scared of snow because I hate powder snow. It's this um, new block in Minecraft 1.20 that works like quicksand you're, you're going to start sinking into the block itself then just slowly freeze you to death <laughs> like quicksand but snow first time i encountered it i didn't know what was going on and i was and i was thinking why why am i dying and i've been terrified of snow ever since See, Minecraft is a horror game at its core. <laughs> you just build enough structure around your cozy little area. Think that you're safe, but when you're out here, just exploring, looking for looking for a flipping village. <laughs> oh, I wonder if my cats will teleport to me. Huh? They don't get left behind. Yeah, go this way. Oh. Kitty, goodbye. This is where I leave you. Now I have I must sail. Be the line where the sky meets the sea. <laughs> Going west. All the way west. You know what? Go at five. There we go. Better. Oh, I do have my Minecraft special surprise reveal today. I haven't done. Still needs a little bit of um, a little bit of tweaks. turtles and I officially lost my cat goodbye cat you will be missed all right we're in the forest it's a regular forest birches and oaks <coughs> probably the most common biome in Minecraft after the plains biome to be honest And we are still villageless then mates. We're already at minus two three nine zero. Still haven't found anything. <laughs> There's nothing in this island. There's nothing on this island. There is nothing on this island. Jump across that one. Maybe just sail on the other side. Oh, that's also a random island, so we probably can't go there. Figure out. Oh, oh, is that another portal? What the hell? Huh? So cool. Did a generate over there? Nice. 
there a chest here too? Oh god. Oh god. Okay. That's just gonna fucking spawn in the island, isn't it? Oh, there's the chest. Mistering melon slices. Might find some iron ingots. Uh, iron nuggets. Section 2 helmet. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. No, still no obsidian though. So you really can't um, finish this uh, nether portal. It looks so cool though. Look at that. The middle of the ocean. Yay, now we have a protection 2 helmet. You know what? Maybe we should just make our own color. Ah! Holy crap! Oh, there was a source block. That's why. <laughs> okay. That scared me. Yes, if you put a magma block above water, it's gonna make all the water blocks above it. Source water source blocks, right? Yeah, it has an added effect of pulling down everything that's in the water towards the magma block. It's what people use for water elevators in this game. But also if you find it in the wild, it means that your boat is pretty much gone. Or at least that's how I understand it. We've been rowing for miles. Nothing but ocean. I think in previous versions of Minecraft, there used to be just one, just one biome of ocean. It was just called ocean. I don't think the different classifications like um, tropical ocean, lukewarm ocean, cold ocean, I don't think those existed. At some point, probably, it was just the basic ones. Here's my axe. Oh, look, lapis. That blue, that lapis. It's actually, cerulean. Izanagi, welcome in. Hope you're doing amazing. Thank you for the daily redeem. We are just playing Minecraft right now, and we have failed in looking for a village so far. Just want a village. <laughs> Can't find one. For some reason. Coal on here. But we don't really need coal. We are about to reach minus 3000 per world here. And. Ah! Doing okay, tired. How is you? You are doing amazing as well. Not really as well because you're tired, I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, we're doing amazing. We started roughly an hour ago. And... Ah! Oh, that's just... Go to bed. Our cat's not with us anymore. Sad. Okay. Take this. Take this. That. Build that. Crafting table here. Oh, probably put it there. Make another bed. We are looking for a village, Izanagi. Welcome in. Um, we're looking for a cauldron. So far, it has been fruitless. Where are these villages? <laughs> I'ma be lurking. All right, all right, sounds good. Thank you so much for dropping by, and I appreciate your lurk. Okay, this one is made of crying obsidian, which means that we can't really open it because crying obsidian doesn't complete the circle. 
See what's in the chest, though. Okay. Oh, chest is all the way there. Hopefully, we can jump across it and not fall in there. <laughs> alright, alright. Why am I doing this this way instead of um, doing the normal way and just walking around it? Sometimes you gotta do dangerous stuff for content. This is one of those opportunities. Aha! But I made it. <gasps> Obsidian! And flint and steel too? Whoa! Whoa, silk touch pickaxe? And a silk touch. Oh no. Oh no, these are good ones. <laughs> unbreaking three. Oh, unbreaking three and protection two. If I combine these in an anvil, that would be a really good helmet. Hmm. We have four obsidian. Ow! <laughs> How much do I need here? One, two, three. Oh, that's. We need way more. We need way more than four. Oh man. Okay. Well, I'll still take it. But you know what this means? I think this means that we might just need to build here. I don't remember of any nether portals that only need four obsidian for it to be complete. But if we put our waystone here. Yeah, but if we put our waystone here, we would have. We would have this, this entire thing. Technically, we don't really need this. We can just. Two, and then three, four. <gasps> I think we can. I think we can, then, mates. Hold on. Let me check. One, two, and then three. Oh my god. Hold on. I think we can. Oh, ah! Fuck! Well, there, there goes. There goes everything. That one could have been there. <laughs> but now we can take that off because we don't have a diamond pickaxe. Oh well. Oh god damn it. <laughs> but I think... Oh no. <laughs> uh, that could have completed it. We would have just needed to replace those two in there. Yes. Crying obsidian can't be used to complete a portal. But, oh my god, I think I have two obsidian at home too. But you know what? Let's put our waystone in here. Ow! Let's put our... Take off these... Take off these leaves here. That should be good. That should be good, right? What are blah, 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 over there? Nether portal. Very creative name. Three levels to get to my house. You know what? You know what? It's a worthy sacrifice. We're at minus 2000 anyway. And our house is at. Yeah, let's. What are we based on? Stone, nether portal. Just to make note of the coordinates. Minus 2. 446 All right. All right. So now we can go to our house for the measly cost of three levels. We have five levels, so if we want to go back here, we would need another level. Which is very convenient actually. It's a resource sink for the levels that you get um throughout the game. Especially if you're at the point where you have villagers set up and you don't really need the experience points anymore. Crap, a bunch of zombies just spawned there. I think, I think there's a cave below us. And, and I can hear them growling. Which means that they are definitely... Oh, hi dogs. Wolf there. We can see it on the minimap here, then mates, but we do have a bunch of zombies on the minimap. And the subtitles say zombie groans. So they must be underground or something. <laughs> anyway. Do we have a bed? We have these lapis and these iron nuggets and gold nuggets. 
if you want, you can definitely chop down a tree. Get some experience points for it, perhaps. And then... You even get experience for chopping down trees? I don't think you do. <laughs> Alright. I think we can also go back, drop off our stuff, which is the, uh, all of the golden stuff. Then... Maybe find a way to go back, but... You know, we can always we can always do that later. But on the other hand, on the other other hand, I have lots of hands tonight, then mates. We can also set up a chest here. Do that. Let's do that. Actually. Make a crafting table. You know what? Maybe we can even make this sort of like a place to to um, bed <laughs> a place to bed I cannot English today hold on place to sleep there we go that's a proper name a place to bed um, where we will have a bed bed then make a chest what to make a chest oh no burning Ow! Hmm. Very interesting. Okay. Need to make another chest. An oak plank. Don't really need that a lot. So. Uh. Chest and bed. Respawn point set. By the nether portal. Just close to the zombies. But we'll put our golden stuff in there. So if in case we die, for some reason, put our obsidian in there too. Where did our obsidian go? Oh, right. We put it on the nether portal. Which, um... Kind of fucked up. <laughs> okay. White wool goes here. White wool on our hotbar for any reason flint and steel would be nice that there all right then mates are ready for more adventures here our waystone is set our respawn point is set spare bed is set we can continue moving west and uh, looking for a village how much farther before we get to see a village? <laughs> we might see a village in the badlands or the desert. We might see a village in the swamp, but that's a very rare. That's a very rare village. And a very rare biome too. So for now, I'm just going to continue west. Maybe there's something in minus oh, oh you know what? Alternatively can also also look for a village at the positive side of the um, of the map at like 2000 2000 or something It'd be a nice adventure but for today's stream it looks like it's just gonna be walking simulator for us and of course finding ravines are very difficult to cross so far, I haven't really seen anything. Oh, emerald. Look at that. There's emerald right there. But not at that point where we're trading with villagers yet. We haven't set up our iron. Iron farm. The problem with the iron farm is... We need gold for it. But to be fair, we did... Pretty sure we have quite a bit of gold set up. We have a river here. Ow! Oh god, oh god, where did that raid come from? 
Thanks, thank you for the raid, Maeve. Thank you, thank you. Welcome in. I don't think my raid works. I don't think my raid integration works. Hold on, let me check that. Husky, welcome in. Thank you for dropping by. <laughs> Maeve raid. <laughs> welcome, welcome into the Lunar Dreamer. My name is Jiro Yodokuma. Welcome to pilot of the Lunar Dreamer and your friendly Space Moon Bear VTuber. I play Minecraft on Mondays. Monday nights actually. Roughly around this time. And on the weekends, I play a variety of games. This weekend is Amnesia Week. Um, I've played Amnesia on my third week streaming. Third week streaming, yeah. Or, yeah, yeah. Third week streaming. Uh, the first Amnesia game, The Dark Descent. And we managed to finish Act 1 and Act 2. It was really fun, but we, nev we never got around to finishing the entire game. And this weekend, that is exactly what we're doing. We'll be trying to finish it. We'll be doing Act 3 and Act 4. And on Wednesday, we will be playing Raft. Uh, another survival video game where you get to build your own boat from any debris that are floating in the ocean. It'll be so much fun. It's going to be a collab with um, two, um, two, two, yeah, with two other bear VTubers. <laughs> Thank you for the read, Maeve. Let me give you a shout out. Maeve Evers. I hope your stream went amazing. <clears throat> I'm gonna prepare my movie announcer voice, which is still a work in progress. Ah! Australia! Very no! <laughs> I was about to do my shout out to Maeve. How could you? <laughs> Smoke Jiro. You know what? <laughs> I'm gonna. I can't adjust that when I'm upside down, Barry. Hold on. Let me check. Let me try. Let me try. God, this is so confusing. Third stream done. But welcome in, welcome in. Thanks for uh, thanks for dropping by, Barry. I think I think I got it right. All right, back to the game. Back to the stream. Do the shout out for Maeve. I do have a raid event set up, but I don't know why it didn't work. Anyway. Shout out. In a world <laughs> of cozy mysteries, Maeve Evers is the VTuber who will steal your heart. This season, join them for a journey through VG3. Saving and flirting go hand in hand. Get ready for gaming with a touch of anime charm. <laughs> Tune in and let the rabbit led adventures begin. Okay, this is a really amazing. Hope your stream is going well. The stream is going amazing. I was supposed to have. Is that a river or is that a really tall? Oh, you know oh it is water. Okay. So if it's water, then we can jump, right? Still haven't found a village. <laughs> Yeah, it's been an hour and a half. Still haven't found a village. I don't know why. How long does it take? I just want I just want a cauldron. I just want a cauldron. What is this? What is this world generation? Off the bed, wanted to stop and say hi. Yeah, thank you so much for um entrusting your community to me. And streaming is a really fun um Really fun thing to do, but I I understand that it takes a lot of your energy. So by all means, please feel free to um, raid and run and take your well earned rest. Thank you for dropping by, and saying hi, and um, saying hi to uh, the Lunar Dreamer deadmates. And I will take care of your community. <laughs> you even want to go there, deadmates? I just want a village. <laughs> I just want 
the village. Eh, you know, you know that's fine. Eh, I wonder why my raid. I'll, I'll figure it out later. Okay. Hmm. Where should we go then, mate? Should we go there? Should we go there? You know what? Let's go there. Let's continue along this mountain. We're already at 3,000. Yeah. Dower Nether Portal is somewhere. I wrote down the bed, uh, the location. Maybe we can just start heading back there. Looks like we're not gonna be finding any villages today. Alright. Yeah, I opened Twitch. Um, and I, and I see that Barry is still streaming. <laughs> it's really funny because Barry, couldn't you be streaming and not summoning spiders on my stream? <laughs> That's way too funny. Uh, okay. I hear a zombie. Oh my god, okay. These are dangerous mountains. It's so cool how they inc how increasing the vertical vertical thingy allows these sorts of impressive landforms to Generated. Those are all drowned. They might have tridents, so I don't want to. Oh, they do have tridents! Holy crap! <laughs> they are mad! <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> okay, calm down! Holy crap, can I mine that? Can I mine that trident? I think I can. Just throwing forks at me, grenades. <laughs> Still looking for a village. We are still still looking for a village and still cauldronless. What's gonna happen? I might just end up. Uh, I'm gonna end up doing. I might just end up. What are the? Oh, it's a mushroom biome. Hmm, interesting. I just end up making it. We can't. We can't find. Oh, this is a dark forest. Dark forest biome. That mean we're gonna find a village soon? Question mark. But you know what? Do we have. Do we have. Wait. Do we have dark oak in our base? I don't remember. Maybe we don't. Maybe this would be the perfect time to get some saplings. Huh. Oh, well, that is a big cave right there. Dark forest biome. Now this is just a regular forest biome, I think. Okay, the problem about these dark forest biomes is that they're so spaced together that their leaves are connected. If I want to get a sapling, it would need to be from a tree that hasn't... Um, but whatever, no, we'll make it work, we'll make it work. It's gonna work out. Make it work. We can make it work. And of course, our axe broke. One more. We will make it work. We'll make the saplings fall down. 
and it's already getting late in the night in our little Minecraft world here, didn't it? Ah, no saplings, of course. There's one. There's something. Oh, rabbit. Did find a dark oak sapling, that's something. And we should probably... Um... Here. We're gonna make a bed. Alright, crafting table. There. Of course, we can make a bed from here. Let's resize my mod. All Jiro redeem is done. The bed. There. Set it as on point. Then we should be good to sleep in a few hours. Probably should make another, maybe two axes as well. Just mining. Grabbing some dark oak logs, which are my second favorite kind of wood. Next to, um, right next to spruce. <laughs> where's, huh? where's the tree that I was chopping? Over here. Right, it's just. Anyway, we're chopping down this one. Second favorite. Second favorite tree type after spruce. I need another two, another two saplings. Then I'll be happy. have lots of space for our uh, inventory so we should be fine as long as those skeletons don't bug us we have a 4x4 four four space here uh, a 4x4 four four, uh, no, not a 4x4 four 2x2 four. Two two block of wood because it's 2 blocks long and 2 blocks wide this one right here can start by making a two block high thingy. Then we're just gonna add a creeper right here. Okay, it wasn't good. Creepers traumatize me. Oh wait, I don't think creeper explosions are turned on in this Minecraft world. I should probably take a look into that. I think it would be way better if I don't have it. There we go, our five saplings. Should we continue going south? You know what, let's... Let's change directions. Yeah, sure. Let's change directions and actually head south. Try to go to positive 3000. Alternatively, we do have five levels. Maybe we could um, go back home, turn in our stuff would require so much more work. 
So we'll just press on, I guess. Try continuing to look for a village. May or may not exist. But that's the fun of it, right? It's in the exploration. We are going south towards positive Z. Where's a positive Z axis? Ow! Where's a positive Z axis? Trying to see what are those? Oh, those are mushrooms. Huh. Interesting. Mushrooms spawn very rarely in caves. That is a drowned. I wonder if this is the same spot with the angry drowned. I don't think it is. I think this is an entirely different spot. Anyway, we are going to positive 3000. Three th ah, I can't English. I'm going to positive 3000 then, mates. Gonna go Moana once more. Thing. Either line where the. Uh, I can't see. <laughs> uh, <I don't> no. <laughs> Out of tune already. Uh, let us go. Let's go this way. Maybe? Question mark. Because we're supposed to be going south and east, right? If you want to go to positive. That's where the positive goes, right? Oh, look. Is that a woodland mansion? No. No. No, it's just a stony thingy. Looks like we reached a ravine. Careful not to fall through that. Oh, it's not really a ravine. <laughs> eh, let's eat. to keep our hunger up we have no more cooked mutton uh, but we do have a uh, lot of coal and a furnace so we can a uh, lot of cobblestone so we can make a furnace and then cook some meat there we are still looking for a village <laughs> been fruitless so far found this random beach random patch of snow in the forest even it wasn't even big enough to be considered a biome I would think it was just a patch of snowy trees I don't know how that happened that's how the randomizer works for you I guess yeah Get in the boat. We are continuing our journey to the south side of the map. We're going to the positive Z direction. We'll see if we can find any villages this way. And it feels like we will quite a while. So I'll turn on third person view. I think that would help. Of course, right when I say that, there's land. <laughs> but we're not going there. We don't want to go there. We want to make our lives harder for us. So that's why we're going here. On this... What is this? What is this place? Why is everything broken? On this beach question mark. God. Okay. All right. Well, that's a plains biome. That's something. Where's my boat? Where's my boat? 
you will burn my boat sail across the sea back to heart of defeat what is that what is that oh those are what what are huh what are those Murder. And murder. And murder. Okay. I'm gonna spare you, chicken. And murder. Go. God. Impressive. What is that? Yo. <laughs> the fuck? That is so cool. Can I just live here? <laughs> Look at this. What would, you, what would we call that? What would we call a natural formation that looks like that? So cool. You know what? Let's take a screenshot. That looks so nice. But we are here to look for a village, not go sightseeing. So we are going to conveniently ignore the amazing landform. Ah, this is. Ah, that is a creeper. No, you don't. Not me. You're not gonna make me explode today. Is that? Oh, that is a that is a jungle. It's already six p.m. in the game. It's getting dark here. Other dolls. Huh? Oh, I think it's just the sunlight hitting the the thingy. But for now, we will go up the swamp. Make our bed here. Obviously, we can't go further. Um, let's do this. A bunch of... Go, crafting table, and then my bed. We are running out of wool. I had 24 to start. Now we have 17. Ah. It would be a good idea to... Start killing more sheep. Oh, why did I do that? Ow! Why did I have to do that twice in a row? This would be funny if we managed to find the witch hut before we find a um. We find a village, and then once we find a village, the small ship not have a cauldron because knowing our luck, that's most likely what's going to happen. What is this? What biome is this? Is this, this just a frozen ocean biome? We managed to look, we managed to find a frozen biome before we found. Oh, it's a frozen river biome. Very interesting. And look, an unfinished portal as well. Obsidian. They have two obsidian den mates. Literally just what we needed to finish that, uh, that thing. Breaking two, we have we have iron boots. So cool. Is that 
packed. That wasn't packed, no. Alright, we're approaching our second hour here. That means we're about to go into another three minutes of ads. And yeah, we have uh, nine minutes, I mean. <laughs> In nine minutes, there will be another three minute ad. I'll, I'll send up another heads up. Uh, a bit closer, probably like two minutes or something. We will run that final set of ads. Maybe we'll call it a night if we haven't found any villages. This is taking so long. I want a village. <laughs> just want a cauldron. So hard to find a cauldron. Maybe I can just craft it. Maybe that's what the game is telling me. I should probably just craft my own. Instead of instead of asking for handouts. <laughs> I, um, this morning on today's Ghostwire Tokyo stream, I raided out to one of my friends, Mary Hatter, and they made the they made a boomer special, <laughs> made a special speech about pulling yourself uh, up by your bootstraps in Minecraft <laughs> and making your own resources. I guess what the con I didn't fully understand what the context was. It was a funny speech. A funny uh, monologue piece. I would have memorized it. <laughs> it been fun to like memorize and randomly announce. I pulled myself up by my bootstraps in Minecraft. Why should I give you some materials? <laughs> if you work hard, one day you will also find some diamonds. <laughs> We're at the taiga biome then mates which means that all of these trees are spruce my favorite kind of wood from my favorite kind of tree god we have an entire stack of sheep meat uh you know what let's do that let's do just that let's uh set up a crafting table somewhere cook this meat Let's, let's, let's build it in the taiga. I kinda don't like how olive the swamp is. Shade of green. It's the olive green shade of green. I like that aesthetic. Very um, industrial. You know, like um, military uniforms are olive green, so you blend in with the foliage. That's what that reminds me. Anyway, they're making a bed. A respawn point, and we are also making a furnace and cook some meat. Here. And that's what we're doing furnace down, put the bed down, of course. Sapling back there. We have five dark oak saplings that we can take home. All we need to do is look for another weight stone, hopefully. Either that, or we just Actually, I think we're way too far from our last waste. But we don't. Not make sense. The waste on nether portals at minus 2923. And we're at minus 1317. So that's literally a thousand blocks. <laughs> it would be a waste of resources. Both my time and yours, then. Us has to go all the way back to the waste zone. Go back to, the how, uh, to our base. And drop off our five dark oak saplings. <laughs> right. We're gonna cook some meat. I think a stack of five should be enough. And if it's not, then we're just gonna grab what we can get. Two pieces of... of blah, 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 blah. We have two pieces of obsidian. Which means that the next waste stone that we find... We can just go to the nether portal, put down the two obsidian blocks that we need, and it should all be good. We still need a diamond pickaxe to mine those though. Okay, here we are just going to wait. 
for the food to cook just like that the mutton and get some health right wouldn't it be interesting if there's some um, some kind of bear mob craft that if you cook something in a furnace or a smoker or actually if you cook something in a smoker it would attract the bear bears because of the aroma <laughs> but at the uh, the benefit is that it cooks faster that would be a good trade-off wouldn't it summon bears to your location with um special furnace to cook food oh i'm getting levels from uh i forgot that you get levels from cooking too that is cool we're right now we're waiting for food then mates we're going to continue south on our journey to find the village but our chances are getting more and more bleak by the minute <laughs> We're almost passing our two hour mark here. And our ad is starting in three minutes as well. That that five pieces of coal actually cooked quite a bit of peat. Huh. It cooked like twelve. That would be um I would call that efficient if there wasn't a more efficient way to put fuel and that is using a um a bucket of lava so cool it's so cool <laughs> uh, the puns okay let's make note of this location actually 989 minus 1316 One three one six. Do we have time to even farm for something? I don't think we would. Yes, we're just gonna just gonna, blah, blah blah. I can't English today. I think we're just gonna need to wait for the meat to cook. There we go. We need to wait for the meat to cook then and then then we leave i think 15 pieces of meat is good enough i think it is we'll just wait we'll just finish this this cycle here we don't want to waste fuel then mates see we'll halfway there and i think 21 pieces of meat should be good way too much if we, if we get into a situation where we need to eat that much food to stay alive obviously there's something that we're doing wrong I think this should be the final cook and then we can go to bed start the day and see if we find any more villages 3620 in the game the stars are out stars are shining, the moon is rising, and the sun is setting over there all the way west of the horizon. Look! The sun. Complementary shaders make the sky look really nice. Clouds actually look like wisps of cloud. Right, now it's 7pm and we must you moving southward uh, oh but first we have to make a bed bed please I kind of feel bad that I that we left our kitty behind then mates part of me and it doesn't care <laughs> No 
know what? This would have been useful. We had the map with us. You know? That way. Oh, what is that? What are, what are those blue things? Those just blue flowers? Yeah, I, I think they are. I mean, there's nothing else. It wouldn't have been. Yeah, it's definitely just blue flowers. Those are cool though. Blue orchids? Are those rare? Why do they show up on my map like that? Ah, channel point relief. Oh, okay. <laughs> Welcome in, Barry. Welcome. Welcome back. I was just, um... I was just talking about earlier how you were... You were still streaming when you summoned Australia. And I thought... And I thought, maybe, maybe she should... Shouldn't she be streaming? <laughs> Instead of sending spiders my way. I am still live talking about it. Yeah, I saw. <laughs> Not really saw because I don't have your stream up just yet. I just saw it on the list of channels that you're still live. But thank you. I'm pretty sure you talking about me is nothing bad. <laughs> Don't give me that emoji. <laughs> this single LOL emoji. <laughs> it is a collab idea. Huh, collab idea. Is it about raft? Jump the lily pad. Jump, jump. I never do parkour. There's some parkour map maps on TikTok where um you jump, uh, you see people jumping on lily pads. Oh god, of course it's raining. And I just, uh, I hate the rain. Part of me just wants to make it not even a thunderstorm too, because it's... Okay, eh, whatever. Plains biome, yeah! Wait, wind swept hill hills? What does that mean? Llama. Oh, okay. Huh. Just drowning out my BGM. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. <laughs> Windswept hills. It's cool. Really cool biome, but utterly worthless any other way. Guess who would live here? It's gravel and stone. But anyway, speaking about lily pads, I've seen some TikTok videos. You know those TikTok videos where an AI reads a Ask Reddit um, am I the asshole post? And then the second half of the screen is just somebody playing parkour on the Minecraft map. And yeah, those kinds of things. I've seen one map where they were jumping on lily pads. And I thought it was so cool. And I thought, hey, maybe I should, maybe I could try that out. Can't be that hard, right? It was really hard, dead mates. <laughs> I can't even, I can't even jump on two lily pads in a row, let alone three. And on the video that I watched, they were jumping on like 10. <laughs> this rain, just go away. Can I sleep through it? I am wet. Ugh, oh, damn it. It's not even a thunderstorm. It's just regular rain. Makes this all the more annoying, I guess. Alright, then, mates, we're at minus 600 on the Z axis here. Should we go all the way to 2000? Or should we stop at zero? 
Call it a knight. I use horses. We have walked. How many blocks have we walked now? Damn. <laughs> But let's see. Go here. Go there. Uh, <clears throat> I can't sing. <laughs> I can't sing properly. Not on stream, at least. No. Um, currently raining. Oh, my model's back. Let me just resize that for you. Take a break from the annoying rain sounds. <laughs> Let's see. All right. They just no, no, no. You can't possibly just have turned around. We're going south this entire time. There's no way. Way. All right. We are continuing our journey south towards positive death. <laughs> and the funny thing is, if we go to zero zero, that's gonna be where our road spawn is. And then, it's gonna be nothing but a um, badlands biome. Remember that? Remember that? Uh, oh wait, hold on. It actually the bad ones, but I don't think it. What's the world spawn in this area? I think that, that so many sheep murder them. Sheep, goodbye. Then time to go. Andrew will keep murdering. We need their will. I would opt for more humane options. But right now, we don't really have a choice. We need the will. <laughs> We need the wall to stay alive. Be here. Two hours in, still no village. That's Minecraft for you. Oh. Ah. No, 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 no. Welcome back then, mates. You didn't miss out on a lot. Still found nothing. 4pm, <laughs> we're facing this ocean, and we found nothing. Well, we continue on, I guess, to the ocean. Maybe we can go to... 1000, perhaps? Maybe not. Oh, and there's a dolphin right behind us. Hi, dolphin. Hi, friend. Oh, look, desert. The perfect biome for a village. Nagi, welcome back, welcome back. I thought you would have you would have been sleeping by now. You mentioned you were tired earlier. <laughs> but welcome back. Thank you for the emotes. Dancing emotes. We are two hours on our stream and we still haven't found a village. We have walked all the way to how far have we walked and it's like 3000 blocks. Still nothing. And oh look. This is the biome that we 
the world spawn on a windswept savanna. They say this is the most, the, the rarest uh, biome in Minecraft because it doesn't really spawn often. But I can see why. There's really no value in any biome that uses stones instead of that's, uh, stone structures instead of trees. What would you use terracotta for if you're in the badlands? Pretty worthless, if you ask me. Alright, we're just looking for a place to put our bed in. Because it's already 7 o'clock and we must bed. And of course, uh, there's a zombie already, all hot on our heels. And we're gonna let him burn to death. What the fuck is that? Is that an iron shovel? Why do you have an iron shovel? Die. Here you go. Rotten flesh. Bad thing about this is... We put our bed in the worst location ever. When we die, we're gonna spawn right there. Really, where we want to go. Huh. Hold on. This way, that way, that way. Let us put this somewhere else. I know we're gonna lose our respawn point, but I think dying shouldn't be that hard to avoid. We've survived without dying almost two hours now. Another two hours, right? Be easy. Just know how to bunny jump, bunny hop, bunny jump. How to bunny hop properly. No, no, <laughs> and know how to climb this mountain. I can English do. Damn. I'm gonna do this. Then now we don't have any more dirt blocks. I lied, we have 51. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Let's just. Fine, let's just leave these blocks here. Look at that. Look at that. Whoop. Whoop. Ow. And we are on the top. Hills. We are going south, though. We are continuing our journey south towards the this, this desert looking thing. Damn it. We wasted all that time going up and now we're going back down. Shouldn't have Can I jump from there? I'm wiser if I don't do that. And instead just graciously fall down, I guess. That's a thing. Lying is just falling down gracefully. Okay. Alright. We are on a beach. Still no village. Still no cauldrons. It's sad if you ask me. But we'll see if we can go. Up, we're going east towards 1,000. Maybe we can get to 1,000 on the z-axis and 1,000 on the x-axis as well. What would be really useful in these, in these kinds of situations is that if I took the map did get from somewhere actually made it useful and put it in my hand as some kind of guide so we can also fill it in but did i think of it no i just decided oh maybe i'm just gonna put it in the chest to be safe there it have been useful to have a map but no. how the game works apparently 
or at the Sunflower Plains Biome. Lots of sunflowers planted. You know the sunflowers in Minecraft also follow the sun? Look! Just moved. <laughs> Very interesting fact that is also something that real life sunflowers do. Very interesting. I can hear my BGM again. Yes. I hope it's not too not too loud or too soft for everyone. Flower forest. You know what else we haven't found? A cherry grove biome. We haven't found it yet. We have a lot we have a few cherry grove trees planted in our base, but Ah, wheat seeds? Is that a village? Yo, is this a village? Why are there wheat seeds being Where are the wheat seeds being taken to? Over here. No wheat seeds. How much wheat? Oh, never mind. It's just a water thing. Yeah, I thought there was a village. Sad. I really need these seeds. find a raid target soon. I don't want to just go to bed early. <laughs> as much as I want to continue exploring, we are still a working bear. I don't want to make sure that we stay awake. Plains biome, wind swept hills biome. Oh, look, we're already at the thousand. Go east now. Do that. Ah! Oh, oh. Scared me. I almost fell there. Still no village. Can't have. I think this is normal chance. You would think we would have found a village by now, right? <laughs> well, such is life. Maybe we'll go again next week. I don't find <laughs> We'll continue our search for a cauldron. But for now, we will um, going to spend the next couple minutes going as far west as we can go. You know what would be funny is that if once we head out of here, the words were about to finish that when when we find a village. Oh, this is just Cherry Grove, still not a village. It was a fun walking simulator. All of you then made some. I enjoyed it. It was nice. Today's stream was more on the very chill side. 
Let's full face. Let's full face. <laughs> Minecart with chest. Huh. Man. I don't have a waystone though. So far away from our last respawn point. I don't think it's worth it. I don't think there would be a waystone there either. See how far we can go for night time. Well, never mind. There's a beach right there. I guess the answer is not that far. Yeah, let's clean it some. Go here instead. I got by it. Peaceful. Wait to end this. need to make oh we do have a bed here never mind right bed make a crafting station that's the loop right make another bed this way, we don't run out of beds. And we don't run out of respawn points too. Now, we can continue our journey east towards positive 1000. Or can it be? And going east, there's 2000 blocks. It wouldn't be that long. We are now in the cold ocean biome. I think the best biome if we want to look for underground. Um, Sea monuments. Those structures that give you sea lanterns. See, just like that. There's a that's a ocean monument right there. Spawn in the deep cold ocean biome, which we are on right now. And I really don't want to get in a fight with those funny looking fish. So I'm just going to skip it. Make our way to 1000 coordinate in the the x-axis here. I guess this is both the best part and the worst part about exploring in Minecraft is that there is some days where you spend hours looking for something end up em and you end up empty-handed. I think what the developers were trying to do with the map and cartography is that they're trying to make it look like you didn't come up with nothing. You actually did a little bit of something that's unlocking the map, but even then, it still feels like you did nothing. I like it though. Is that a frozen ocean biome? Ayo. Frozen river biome then. We are boating on ice right now. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, it didn't, it didn't lead us into a... Did it lead us into an, a cave? That would be spooky. Biome. That is very interesting. 
that all there is over here nothing but ice is that an ice ice spikes biome the frozen it's a frozen ocean biome polar bears and stuff oh, cool Drift. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on. Going east. East. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Perfect. No planes. Polar bear gonna eat me. Hope he does. But right now we're stuck. Like, God, I hate this. I hate this biome. See, we managed to find a biome that I hate before we found the village. Pitaiga. Wonder if this. Uh. -oh. How there's no hope it doesn't. That shit is scary. Stuff involved in that. Oh, uh, at least there's trees, I guess. Uh. In. Snowy Taiga Biome. Still no village, then mates, still no village. where we're gonna be It's gonna go here. Still the snowy plains biome. Very interesting. I think powdered snow happens in the snowy plains biome. Might be wrong though. But so far all I see is um this layer of snow above a dirt block. Perfectly fine with that. Let's see what else is here. Man. The moment I find another waystone, I'm gonna go all the way back home. Off everything. Then kill some monsters. Then go back to the nether portal, build the obsidian thing. We do have two obsidian pieces here. I think that's what we're going to do for our next session. Uh, next
next week. Now I see nothing but snow here. Sad. Own way. Zombie villager? I mean, there's a village nearby? Huh. <gasps> Dead mates! <laughs> Found the village! Yo, why does this always happen? Literally at the end of a stream. Every time. <laughs> Found the village. Look at that. Look at these snow people. There's a waystone. Oh my god. <laughs> After two and a half hours, found ourselves a village. Well, let's activate that. Let's activate that waystone. You know what? Let's remove it and rename it because Ray Ray Zuarzer is not really very descriptive. Let's rename it as Snow Village. You know something? I'm not that great. <laughs> And it only costs two levels to go to our house. Three levels to the nether portal. This is, oh my god, this is perfect. And I hope they have... They better have a flipping... What are we looking for? <laughs> You better have a beeping cauldron. There we go. That's what we were looking for. All right, 6:30 p.m. Oh wait, huh? 6:35. Good night. Probably sleeps. All right, let's look for. Look for a. That is a very dangerous. I think there's any things down there. Oop. I don't think there would be any. Um, cauldrons down there. I think that if they do have cauldrons, it would be outside. Inside. Only the furnace. Oh, it's snowing. Okay, perfect. So cozy. I like this. I like this village. I think I've seen oh, no fur, no cauldron. This is a brewer, which means there's a cleric here somewhere. Hello. Welcome in, MJ Drift. Thank you for dropping by. Hope your night's doing amazing. You're just play alone? I yes I do. <laughs> Diamonds, first diamond, I don't think so. Oak saplings, oh, iron leggings, um, oxidized copper boots. Ah. 
few more as well. I want to invite you to server. Um, I'm actually working on a um, multiplayer server as well. <laughs> uh, I'm at five multiplayer servers at the moment. So, for the invitation, but I have a pass for now, MJ. I'm sorry about that. Looking for four. Okay, okay. Uh, thank you for understanding. Thank you so much. Yeah. You're looking for a cauldron. We haven't found it, but we do have a village. We can teleport back to our. Teleport back to our home base if we But right now, I don't think any. The cultures here as well. Yep, we already visited that earlier. And we already visited the waste stone earlier as well. What this one? Nope, just a bed. Maybe I'll just need to craft my own cauldrons then. Can't find some. Alright, I guess we'll do that next week. Look at this igloo. Look at that. And it's packed ice too. So cool. Already went there. Right? Pretty sure we already did. Wait, there's a weaponsmith over there. Maybe. Yeah, some friends. <gasps> See lava. That's promising. That's promising. We have cauldrons inside. Damn. That's where we found that diamond thing. Well. Let's go back and put back our diamonds, I guess. What about this one? Nope, 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 nope. I already saw that. That is very sad. Well. We'll go back to the waystone and um make our own things, I guess. Back to a base. And we're back. Parrot. Oh, so sad that my cat is gone. It's interesting how they just spawned back, I guess. Or maybe they were there all this time and they were left behind when I used the waste stone. We'll never know, I guess. Our house is just over here. That was a fun adventure. We didn't find it. Ah! <laughs> we didn't find any cauldrons. But I guess we just have to make it ourselves. Need to look for... Just need to look for more iron. What, maybe we can trade with... We can do that. Trade sticks for emeralds and then trade emeralds for iron. But... For home and... Matters. Put our diamonds there have enough for two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. one more obsidian to build a fully functional nether portal wherever we want because it's pretty sure you need ten. wait 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 I might be lying hold on 
platform, another Four by five minimum. It has to be me. Six and no, ten pieces. Ten obsidian blocks. We have nine. But we'll just put everything in here. Like we always do. We do have our five dark oak saplings, so we can do that. We can plant that. Uh what else? Um well, we do have iron leggings. We have lots of coal. We have lots of dark oak logs too. And lots of birch. But we don't need but this will just have it here. Our rabbit though, our rabbit hide. We don't need those. Especially rotten flesh. And the gold nuggets too. Alright, so we do have quite a bit of things that we left on all the other waystones. Especially on the nether portal one. Left our gold stuff in there. But I think that's gonna be it for our adventure today. Let's look at the potential raid targets here. Channel. Because it's almost midnight. streaming <laughs> they're playing a lego character that's so cool thing here I don't know which one to wait hold on let's see ah let me move myself a little so much for dropping by <laughs> uh thank you for the raid wave thank you so much for the raid i appreciate it and oh we're still in <laughs> it looks like we're still at the spanish subtitles but that's okay um today we didn't <laughs> we didn't do we didn't do a lot <laughs> to be honest but um you know what let's let's raid to honey i don't think we've raided them before <laughs> Let us do that. Um, we'll a no clip shout out to Honey Dory. You're an amazing bear VTuber as well. For those of you who are on Twitch Mobile, or for some reason you got left behind on the raid, feel free to click on the link. Uh, check their profile, give them a follow. We have raid messages set up. Please feel free to use raid 1. Left uh, to leave a raid message to Honey. Raid 2 if you're a subscriber. And with that, I th uh, we will be ending the stream. I will see you again on Wednesday for some uh, Raft. Uh, we will be playing Raft. Uh, it's going to be a collab with two bears. 
um that would be that would be honey dory actually and uh, Terberry. and we will be bringing back crowd control for this collab which means that your um bits will you can exchange your bits for crowd control credits you can affect the game control the game that we're playing it's gonna be fun it's gonna be chaotic especially with uh berry's community <laughs> and honey's community as well so yeah thank you so much for dropping by and i'll see you again on wednesday otsukuma bye bye